the Seeker defeated Dark and Raw, and the people were free forever from his cruelty. That's a lovely story. Tell me another one. Do you want to hear my favorite? I want to hear all of your stories. It's about a man who loves a woman so much that he would give his life twice over just to hold her. I know that one. It doesn't end the way you want it to. Melody, I would swim across an ocean. I would slay dragons, anything to touch you just once. I have to go. Wait. When will I? When I last saw Zed, we were on the road near Dalmore. He headed east towards Eritrea. He said he'd come back to find us when his mission was finished. Travel in the direction he went, and if we're lucky, you'll find him heading back your way. I need you to give him the ring. And then he'll be able to get you out of the valley. And Nelody, too? I don't know. Excuse me, friends. Have you seen a tall man with long white hair pass through here? I spoke to a man in Delmore. He said he had seen him on this road a few days ago. He might be able to help you. But it'll cost you 10 shillings. Well, I don't have any money. I'll have to ask somewhere else. No. You can't take that. Please. It can't be worth much to you. Well, the fate of the world depends on it. The fate of the world? Well, no one's ever tried that excuse before. You all right, young man? You're Zedekus, the wizard. That's right. The seeker told me to find you. Other, but never be able to touch. I'm happy for you both. 